The search is on for a man who pushed a driver out of a car and then almost knocked an officer to the ground. The wild chase started at a Walmart in Gwinnett County. Channel 2 Steve Gelbach live on Pleasant Hill Road. Steve, everything there was caught on those police cameras. First dash camera from the patrol car and then on the officer's body camera. And it all started here over a shoplifting call for stolen underwear and laundry detergent. Duluth police try to pull over this blue Honda, but the driver is pushed out. And when Officer Bian Kang gets to the car, he's almost hit by the door. The suspect gets behind the wheel and takes off down Pleasant Hill Road. Watch closely as the chase moves on to Steve Reynolds Boulevard, then up onto the sidewalk to avoid traffic, narrowly missing this bus stop. The suspect, later identified as Naquan Brandt, appears to crash a couple times before turning into a subdivision and ditching the car. Kang and other officers, including police canines, spent more than an hour on foot looking for Brandt. Flew down and, like, and we found the car. We found the car, so he's running there, man. Good luck, guys. The car was found in a driveway. Police, open the door! But the suspect was nowhere to be found. You could have shot, like, and killed us, you know? And I said, no, I'm pulling over. Later, a police body camera recorded victim Chet Bushy described getting pushed and kicked out of the car. I just remember falling out of the I, I kind of gradually, you know, and as I was falling, he gave me one last kick because he would have ran me over. But despite the close calls and dangerous moves, police say no one was hurt. We also learned that Quan Brandt is out on probation from a 2010 drive-by shooting case in Barrow County. Police have been looking for him now for more than a week. Anyone with information is urged to call Duluth Police for Crime Stoppers.